Hi guys, it's GSL Dice here and Happy New Year to you all. Um, this is my Happy New Year video. I'm going to be going through my zombie stats, some of my multiplayer stats and I'm going to be prestiging for you guys to fourth prestige. You can see the emblem just now, it's like an eagle with a third eye, I would say. Like, that looks like an eye that it's holding with its claws there. Bit creepy if you ask me, but still. Um, since making this video, I've actually uh, completed the haymaker, but in this one, at this point, I had done everything but the haymaker and the man of war, um, and the boy knife. Uh, I still haven't found out how to level that up, or how I managed to level up that tiny little bit, like, who knows. Um, for the liquid divinium, I've got 30. I've made a video of me opening them, and I'll be putting that up shortly. Uh, I'll be using a lot of my Mega Gun rolls, um, I figure, why not? I've been saving a few of them for, like, either a particular map or to go with a set, or... For example, the one at the top left, can't remember what it's called, lets you get, keep your perks when you get revived. So I want to keep that for with Perkaholic, where you have all the perks. You know, things like that. And then I'm keeping the Perkaholic for when I play Shadows of Evil, because there's a lot more perks on Shadows of Evil. Also, since doing this, I've completed the Shiva, I've gotten that Hex Camo. Um, but again, even this one, I'm close to it, but it's a gun that you pretty much use at the start and then throw away, you know, forget about. Sorry there, just taking a wee drink. <sighs> Alright. So, yep. Yeah. Uh, YouTube the gamer tag. Happy New Year to you all. Uh, I did say in my Christmas one uh, I was gonna make a Happy New Year's video, so I thought why not go out a wee bit daft, or a wee bit different. And I thought why not stick it in the emblem. And then when I was putting it in the emblem, I was thinking whereabouts can I put it? And I was actually thinking about putting it in the two dull corners. And then I thought even better, why not put it in between the letters in a, like in a luminous colour, you know? But yep, there you go. That's me at fourth prestige. Permanently unlock the haymaker because it had I had more left to do on the haymaker, so I figured well, I may as well do that then. Uh, right, so obviously I have a few guns permanently unlocked, so it's a case of. The annoying thing is that then you have to go through and you have to put all the attachments back on, but with my stats here, they still, still seems a bit crazy, you know, my average rounds per game at ratings is 13, but my average score at ratings is over half a million. <sighs> Multiplayer stats not the best in the world, not point nines there, uh, I'm gonna try and get them up, I've been playing uh, core recently actually, core team deathmatch. And I can get why a lot of people play it, like, I'm pulling off some stupid KDs and I've been pulling off, like, some 4s, um, a couple of 2s, well, not a couple of 2s, but a few 2s, uh, but all positives, like, and then I go into hardcore, and then it's, like, even. <laughs> and it's, okay, I can see why people started to play core. But, um, I've done quite a bit for uh, Ronin, I've been trying to get all of his complete, but I've been using all different ones, like... You know, I think I've had, I've had a shot at them all, at one point or another, but some of them, like, the guy with the knife, I, I don't like him. I think that's maybe a core mode thing, though. I tried him on hardcore, which obviously is a lot harder to do. But I think he might be really good on core, but for hardcore, no, I wouldn't recommend him. Uh, I got a helmet for him, uh, out of one of the cases that you get. Um, I honestly can't remember what they're called now off the top of my head. Um... Here's a wee look at some of the setups that I've got. Um, couple of camos for some of the guns for multiplayer. I don't really tend to aim for headshots, so I don't really tend to get the camos. 